So this is the sixth night that we actually read and um, explore the meaning of some of the sutras. And this year we are, t we are, we are exploring the seven parables, which uh, we are only able to do two. The, f the first one is the parable of the burning house, the second one is the parable of the poor son, and then the next one is the plants, the medicinal plants, and then the parable of the fantasy castle city, and then there's ex uh, chapter 8, the parable of the assurance for the 500 disciples, and then the 14th chapter, the parable of safe and easy practices, and the six chapter 16 is the lifetime of a Tathagata. So this tonight we are still exploring this chapter four, the faith and understanding in uh, which in there there is the parable of the poor son. <coughs> we have looked at this yesterday. Okay. So remember, remember uh, what actually um, th those um, are highlighted in red meant, okay? So uh, it means these. 故在本处下劣之心亦未能舍啊，言其所指故在本处下劣之心亦未能舍。So we we have to look at the last sentence. I think we actually touched on it yesterday. Um, so he said he was uh, unable to get rid of his sense of uh, inferiority. And the whole, the whole passage, that means uh, it actually tells you that he, t he doesn't want to move into the mansion with his uh, father. After some time had passed, the father saw that, uh, no, not that, fa not that one, uh, 144, 144, yeah. So uh, after that, his, his father said, you can move into the place, uh, but he, he actually chose to, to stay. He, let's see, after that, the, he, they gained confidence in each other. The father and son gained confidence in each other, and the son felt that he could come and go easily. That means his practice is, is maturing, and he can actually uh, go, uh, 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 come into the mansion of the father that means the house of Dhamma, and then go, go back again. But yet he continued to live in the same place as before. That means he did not choose to come in to stay permanently in that house where his father resided. And that house where he f his father resided was the house of Dhamma, the house of the one Buddha way Dhamma. It's not the house of the two vehicles. OK， 嗱佢喺呢度咧就話，佢話言其所指啊，故在本處下劣之心亦未能捨。佢即係話呢個仔咧係選擇點啊？選擇留喺留喺呢個一乘法以外嘅二乘法，啊留喺個二乘法入邊咧，唔入去入去呢個一乘法嘅屋。嗰、那個屋啊，佢爸爸住嗰、那個長者住嗰間屋咧，就係、是、代表一乘法，即係嚇。咁咁佢就係選擇咗個，因為點解啊？琴日啊，阿 Fredman 個點解？佢因為佢覺得呢個一呢、这個二乘法我都夠噶啦。佢唔知道原來二乘法同一乘一乘法嘅個中間嗰、那個誒涅盤係根本唔同啊。Because he didn't understand, uh, Fred asked the question why he chose to stay in the two vehicles and not go into the take the take the one Buddha way vehicle. Because he didn't understand, he didn't know that there is a difference between the the nibbanic stage. <laughs> Of the two vehicles and the nibbana stage of complete enlightenment, uh, Buddhahood. So he chose to stay there, and because of that ignorance, that inside there is a, a, a tinge of uh, arrogance in there. So that's why he chose to stay. Okay. So we looked at that yesterday. So today we. Uh, 好啦，我哋求求誒睇過啦。咁我哋今日就睇個睇呢個一個因 conditions mature 因緣成熟啦。咁係佛經佛經小事哦。佛經嘅小事就喺誒呢一六頁啊！佛經小事，父之子以佔以通泰，成就大智先，自彼先心臨欲中時。臨欲中係講呢個誒誒誒誒老人家呵，佢父之子以，即係呢個父親知道呢個仔咧，個仔咩啊？個心意佔以通泰已經通通達啦。
，承受大志，自彼先心即系话佢觉得原来我以前啊呢个心识啊睇呢个二乘法嘅心识啊系错嘅，我已经唔再觉得自己以前嗰个咁咁咁诶咁修二乘法系好事嚟，自彼即系睇唔起以前先即系以前个心。OK， so look at this.、Uh, English one. And after some time, the father saw that his son was gradually becoming more confident and accomplished, and confident and accomplished in what? In in the practice, in the practice of the two vehicles. Okay, but yet he continu continues to come into the house and go back, come into the house. So he actually encountered the the one Buddha vehicle, but he did not put his total heart into it. But because of his maturity through this. Practice in the two vehicle, he getting more com accomplished and more confident, and he started to despise his former state of inferiority. That inferiority, just it, it he it's just it means that he now noticed there is a very big difference between what his father taught and what he was learning, and he's he. Actually, started to see that whatever inferiority that he had, uh, in whatever th uh, the two vehicles that he was practicing, wasn't as good as this one. Okay, so he 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 despised that. That means he doesn't like that former state. It doesn't mean that he he、uh, he belittled that two vehicles. It doesn't mean that. So despise is really not the best word to use. To use,、um, but but that's 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 the I think that's the also the best word to describe it, okay. But it's just that、um, uh, it means that he knows he start to know that that is incomparable between the two vehicles, okay. 而命其子并会亲族即自宣言，即系佢话咧，请晒啲亲朋戚友嚟啦，系咪啊？伯个伯老父系咪请派啲亲朋戚友嚟啊？因为就死啦嘛。爸爸就先，呢、这個臨慾終時即係解咩意思啊 ？So right here he said, and then、uh, the the father is dying. The father is dying, seeing that the son was gradually realizing that his own end was near. Page one forty five. Okay, one two three. If you want to read it, page one forty five in the English book is the the third line. Realizing his own end was near, that means the old man's end was near. He's dying. He ordered his son to arrange a meeting with his relatives, the king, the ministers, nobles, and ordinary citizens. That means he called everybody in. What do you think this simile is about? What do you think this metaphor? What what does it represents? Lam Yok Chung Si. Dying. His own end was near. Whose own end? The Buddha owns end. Who got Lam Yok Chung? Ah, Fat Tho. Ah, Fat Tho. Yap Nip. Ah, Hai. Ah, Fat Tho. Yap Nip. Ah, Yap Nip. Ah, Yap Nip. Yap Nip. Pun. Ah, He Yap Nip. Ah, So He. 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 叫曬所有人嚟啊！話我點啊？我將會入滅啊 ！So remember the Buddha, almost near the time of his death, he called everybody. I am going to go soon. Please announce. Remember Ananda. Ananda was there. Ananda didn't want to announce. Ananda was lamenting. He didn't want to leave the Buddha. He didn't want the Buddha to leave us. So he was lamenting. He was. He didn't want. He, he didn't want to face it. So eventually, the Buddha said, "I am going to go in, into Nibbana soon." So this is Lam Yuk Chung. So this is the father, which represents Fat Tho. Fat Tho Lam Yuk Chung. Lam Ming Chung. He knows that he has to start to fill up all his things. Ah, so he asked all the people. He said, "Lord, please tell me what to do. I want to die. 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 I want to
先所出来是子所至。佢话佢话呢个实在系我仔嚟嘅，因为以前咧佢走咗去，吓佢而家翻咗嚟啦。吓、啊、我我我叫咩名，佢叫咩名。啊！咁而家我揾到佢啦，咁佢而家出現喺呢度啦。咁呢個真係我個仔，我係真係佢個爸爸。而我而家所有一個財一切嘅財物都係歸佢噶啦。啊，唔會啊，唔會俾大個第二個噶啦。咁即係即係咩事啊？即係話喺呢喺呢個時候咧，佛陀就話：我而家將呢本咁殊勝嘅《法華經》。咁殊勝嘅佛，我交託咗俾佢。佢個遺產就係呢本《法華經》交咗俾你。呢、这個成佛之道，我交咗俾你啦。啊，你哋個個都要知道，即係同啲大神講啦。你哋係大神，你個個都知道呢個係我仔，我係佢佢個爸爸。我而家就將呢本成佛之道嘅《法華經》交俾佢。喺呢度啊，喺呢度咧，喺呢度咧就係話，因為呢、这個呢、这個仔。相開始相信啦，開始明白啦，而後點啊？佢開始開始真係成熟修行啦。你記得我哋舊年講《法華經》嘛？《法華經》佛陀係點樣去引導眾生啊？係四個階段啊！記得邊四個嘛？第一個係開，唔入，唔係入，唔唔咗先至入。啊、uh, ，OK， so 呢、这个呢、这个就系、是、呢、这个就系、是、啊啊喺喺喺嗰阵时佛诶呢、这个老父知道儿子已经够晒成熟，可以接受呢个法啊，全部交俾佢。So this one here， and and he gather the father gather everybody， everybody to announce this is my son。I am his father, because he has left. Now he has returned. Now he has matured. Now I am dying, and I am going to leave all my inheritance, all my assets to him. So, what are the inheritance? What are the assets? Assets that this this old man is leaving. This old man, the Buddha, is leaving to the poor son. The teachings, especially the Lotus Sutra. Because we are talking about Lotus Sutra, especially the Lotus Sutra, because the Lotus Sutra is the teachings on the path to Buddhahood. Okay, so he said, "You all, all these, all these friends, all these relatives, all these kings, all these Brahmas, Brahmins, don't worry. This is my son, and he is mature enough to take it. But remember." Last year, I I talk about、uh, Lotus Sutra. There are four stages of how the Buddha actually lead us to understand the path to Buddhahood through Lotus Sutra. What are the four different states or stages? Remember? Open. Demonstrate. Huh? Appre apprehend. Apprehend. And very good. <sighs> hey, not bad. Did you really remember? Yeah, that's great. That's good. You see, that's that's a wonder. That's a wonderful thing about listening to to this course. You actually remember and you learn from there. So this is the whole thing. So the the actually the father from day one and when the son actually returned, he already started to open. The, the the path to Buddhahood, and he shows the son how to become, how to actually walk on this path, right? He show him don't be lazy, right? He is he is he he. I find the son's time, he is start to teach the son how to do what? What? Remove the dung, remove the dung, right? That is the beginning. The beginning is what? 佢試驗出嚟應該點做啊 ？Demonstrate 哦，嗱，你揸住個揸住個兜嚇，你要勤力啊，唔好懶惰啊。So demonstrate that he remembered the 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 father took took off all his soft clothing, took off all the ornaments, 
took out all the decorations and put on very dirty, rough, coarse clothes and take up a pen and go at, go go and close to the near to the sun and remove the dunk and told the sun, don't be lazy, work diligently. And I am Mo, you are young and vigorous. Okay. So the what is the apprehend that means he start to understand, he start to realize that's realization. He started to realize the essence, uh, the wonderful teachings. He started to realize this the fruits of this path. Yap Ladima. So what is enter? Enter that means he's entering into this path and he started to what? To attain. Okay? So in this passage of the world earner one, when the poor son heard these words of his father, having gained something he had never had before, he was filled with joy and he thought, without any intention or effort on my part, these treasures have now come to me by themselves. 實在他是不是真的我本無心有所希求 有求那個國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的國家的
your mind is craving for the attainment, for the final result, and you are actually walking towards the wrong direction, the opposite direction. You're not going to get anywhere because your mind is trapped by that greed. Your mind is trapped by that wishing to get, by that expectation to gain. Okay, so he said, these treasures have come to me by themselves. Of course they will come th by themselves because you already removed so much dung. I always say, I always teach in meditation is, meditation is to be aware and you just have to be aware, you just have to be aware. You don't have to do anything, why? Because when you, have, when you become aware and you just accept it the way it is, whatever that comes up, you accept it the way it is, actually you are renouncing that. When you renounce the sufferings, happiness naturally will be there. One grain, one, no matter how minute sufferings you renounce, that minute space is going to be filled with happiness, isn't it? Are you still here? How come you are so motionless and feelingless? Give me some smile, please. <laughs> okay. Right? So you understand, right? So just like the just like the sewer, if if it's plugged and you just clean it up, the more you clean, the more the water can go through. That's the same with that dung. The more dung you remove, the more space you, you have, you're going to put in the good stuff, then it's going to be filled with non-dung non, non thing. That means happiness. Okay? When you have a lot of sleep, you have a lot of space. You have a lot of space, and you will put some of the sleep in there. Right? 是不是,當你能夠可以在一個苦難裡有一點點的苦難,就是一點點的快樂,一點點的平安,一點點的自在。So we don't have to do anything. We play dumb. But we are actually very smart. Because we are not reacting. When we don't react, there is no like and dislike. We just, we just watch and we just try our best to live our life the way it is. Then eventually, hopefully, naturally, these treasures will come. Okay? So you say, you, say you pray to the Buddha, Oh, Buddha, please, please, give me, give me treasure. Hey, Fatna, Fatna, you're not going to get it. OK, you catch it, I'm throwing it out to you. <laughs> You're daydreaming. You're daydreaming. You're daydreaming. You're so in this lifetime, if we, we have been a wandering son, wandering son, remember, come back here to return back home, to come home. Come home to where? Not your physical home. Come home to here. This heart, mind, come home to here. You'll find that compassion, that peace, and that wisdom in here, that treasures in here. It's not outside. 他不是在外面的,這些寶不是在外面的,在裡面的 We have so much dung that's covering up all these treasures 我們很多份,這份就遮住了這些寶 So we have to continue to remove the dung <laughs> I like the dung <laughs> I like the word the dung so, so what does this whole thing metaphor, I mean, represents? Uh, what, what is this metaphor? He is a great master. This old man, what, 
this old man is the Tathagata, is the Buddha. Okay, so I'm going back and forth, okay, so that you can see the Chinese and the English. All the Gai and we are like the Buddha's children. Are we like the Buddha's children? Oh, a children or student, whatever you want to call it, all right? So this is on, uh, sorry, I forgot to write down the page. Oh, still on page 145, the last big paragraph, well-honored one, 145. Okay. So we are the, 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 the Buddha's children. The Tathagata has always taught that we are his children. Because of the three kinds of suffering, we'll honor one in the midst of birth and death. We have borne all kinds of passionate worries. Samfu, oh, how's he? Megil Samfu. What is the three kinds of sufferings? The first kind of sufferings is sufferings. <laughs> what about the second kind of sufferings? Huh? What is the second one? Yeah, change. Why for sufferings due to change? Why is suffering due to change? Why is change a suffering? Give me a smile and you think that I can take that as an answer? <laughs> huh? Attachment. Because we don't want it to change, right? Yeah. So attachment and clinging. You know, all the chop chop team guy. The third one is Sankara Dukkha. Sankara Dukkha so the second one, the, the, the sufferings due to change is because we don't want to lose the pleasant feelings. And then the third is the Sankara Dukkha, the sufferings due to this reactive mind, is because we don't like change. We don't, we attach to likes and dislikes, pleasant and unpleasant, and whenever that, t that change, we don't like it. That's the three kinds of suffering. This is that because of these three kinds of sufferings, we constantly go into this realm, this cyclic what? cycles, the cycles of samsara. Because of these passionate worries, we constantly go into this cycles of samsara. What is you saying? I'm going to go so we prefer what? Being confused and ignorant, we enjoy attachment to lesser teachings. Easier. 
。保持失法 path is a very difficult path。菩萨行系一个好难嘅行行嚟嘅。你谂下，人哋割你耳仔，你都笑喎。So somebody take you take click your eye, remember？ 边个边个摸只眼捐俾人噶？吓？衰菩提定舍利弗啊？ Who offer an eye? Selifat or Sui Bodhi? Selifat, yeah. Selifat, Saraputra. Offer an eye to help the son's mother because he said, "My mother need an eye for medicine," so he took out the right eye. And gave it to the son. Take it home, to so that your mother can be cured. And the son said, "You're wrong. I don't need the right eye. I need the left eye." So he threw the right eye onto the ground and trotted, and broke it. And then Saraputra said, oh, "Sentient beings are very difficult." Bodhisattva path is very difficult, but still I have vowed to be a bodhisattva. Okay, I take my left eye. There you go. Take my left eye. 记得嘛？舍利弗啦，我只右眼捐俾俾个男仔，你拎翻去医你阿妈啦。佢话我都冇，你咁快做咩啫？我都唔系我只右眼，我要只左眼啊！你左眼，你俾只右眼医唔好阿妈噶，抌咗落地踩烂佢。舍利弗话：，哎呀，众生得难调难服啊！原来当菩萨好辛苦噶，好难噶做菩萨。佢话：，但系我已经发咗愿做菩萨啦。好啦，我就俾埋只左眼你啦。咁，我就左眼俾埋佢。修菩萨好辛苦 ，it's very difficult to walk on the Bodhisattva path. It's very difficult. So, you, you guys, I mean not you guys, you folks. By some of you on the on the eighth of uh, on the eighth of uh, 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 April, offer your your body for the for the well beings of sentient beings, and you have to hide it. You have to hide it because people will think that you are. This is a cult, burning yourself. This is what what kind of what kind of practice is this? You see, so difficult, even to be frank, to open to others. We can be. It's so difficult. 好似你哋有啲人啊，四月初八咪燃燃燃香啊，系咪啊？啊，我叫你着翻件长长袖衫啊，唔好露露臂啊，费事人哋问你啊。又要睇医生又话你做咩啊？你而家喺度收邪法啦，系咪啊？我哋都唔能够坦诚话俾人听，我行菩萨道啊，我学菩萨啦。人哋话你傻噶 ，People say that you're crazy, burning yourself. This is the Bodhisattva path. <laughs> Because they don't understand, right? Right? They don't understand. It's very difficult. It's really not easy, huh? Okay. 咁佢话，佢话今日世尊令我等思维捐除诸法气轮之分啊！我等于中勤加精进，得至涅盘一日之格。佢话今日啊，佛陀啊，你讲咗俾我听啊，原来啊，抌低晒呢个二乘法啊，呢个气轮嘅。分辨啊，嗬，分分啊，呢啲二乘法啊，哇！我勤加精進，得一日涅盤，一如果能涅盤能夠係一日咋，一日嘅涅盤啊，已經快樂到不得了啦。佢話：心大歡喜，自以為足啊，便至為然依佛法中勤精進故所得雲多啊。佢話：哇！原來喺佛法入邊啊，喺呢個大乘一乘法入邊啊，能夠勤加精進，好精好好勤力。好精進，原來得到翻嚟嘅寶藏係咁多咁多啊！嚇 ，and then he said, today the world owner one has led us to ponder over and to rid ourselves of such teachings and all the dunk of diverting discussions. We said to ourselves, due to our diligence, perseverance in the Buddha Dharma, that means the one, the one Buddha Dharma, we have received. Many rewards. That means big treasures. You see, he said, just practice it 
diligently and even just for a very short time and that joy that they get from that one day of Nibbanic experience, that was a big treasure, huge treasure, incomparable. The lesser vehicles cannot compare to this. All right? So, here he said, 今我等方之世转于佛智慧无所论识啊. So he said, now in this sutra, the Buddha teaches only the one vehicle. Although in the past, he, he spoke despairingly in the presence of Buddha of the Svarakas liking for lesser teachings. In reality, he was using the great vehicle to teach and transform us. Okay, so, Hello, so in here, actually, he said, what does it mean is, in the past, we actually doubt about the Buddha being very stingy. He didn't want to teach us the one Buddha Dhamma. He didn't want to teach us that path. But unknowingly, and un unknowingly, he was already teaching it, but it's just that we are ignorant. We didn't know. If we would have if we would have started practicing this one Buddha dham, one dham, one Buddha way 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 earlier, if we would have that vow way way earlier, the Buddha would have taught us way earlier. So whose fault is that? Our fault. Bingo ge chowa. Hai o ni zi ge zhou shi zhe guan fa tuo mei shi le, hai bei ya. 他说,于此经中为说一成而适于菩萨前,为子圣文,阿佛法者,言佛实以大成教法,是故我等说本无心有所希求,今法王大宝自然而至于佛子所应得者,皆以得之。所以除了我们需要由等得我们去练习这个小乘而用种种的方便让我们从这个二乘法三乘法来教化我们等我们可以怎样等我们将来可以希望进入去一乘法我因为我们那时候不知道原来我们真的还可以修一乘法我们无知
I vow to walk on this path. And when I vow to walk on this path, the Buddha start to teach. And when the Buddha start to teach, I start to get all these treasures. Okay? So, so now he says, since it is something that children of the Buddha should acquire, we have all acquired. He said, now he said, uh, let's see, 方便了。我等不知身,今我奉知世传,所以就,我等色来真是佛子,但阿修法,若我等有阿大之心,佛则说是大成佛。我等说本无心而有所希求,今法王大宝自然而至于佛子所应得啊。这个大宝自然而至,
What does it mean？ 捐除氣輪，即係將個二成法制低落嚟。So abandon the lesser achievements. Yeah, that means to leave that two vehicles. 最尾就窮途顛倒，即係話佢好好好好好窮啦，又好好老倒啦，係咪？睇唔到啊！窮途顛倒。The sun was very poor and distraught. What does it mean? 生死啊，生死熱老啊，生死熱老啊。That means the samsara of constant cycles of birth and death. 係咪好明容易明白啊 ？It's under, easier to understand with a chart like this, yeah? Good. 所以我哋要知道啦，真係大恩難報，佛陀嘅大恩難報 ，immense gratitude. If you want to read it on、uh, on 155 English, it's in the verses. It's the second last verse. The world honor one in his Great grace, making use of rare things, teaches and transforms us out of sympathy, enriching us, even in countless hundreds of millions of eons. The Chinese can read, and I can read in English. Who could repay him? Who could repay him? And even if we offer our hands and feet, pay respect by bowing our he- heads. And make all kinds of offerings. None of us could ever repay him. If we carry him on our head, or on our two shoulders, through as many eons as the sands of the Ganges, wholeheartedly rev- revering him, offering him the best of food, countless jeweled robes, all kinds of bedding, and every sort of medications. If with ox head sandalwood. And all kinds of jewels, we built stupas, and carpeted the ground with jeweled robes. If we did all such things as offerings, through as many eons, that means long, long time, as the sands of the Ganges, that means so many sands in the Ganges River, still we would not be able to repay him. Didn't this touch your heart? 有冇触动到你个心啊？我哋欠佛陀好多嘢啊 ！We owe him so much. We owe him so much. 我次次读到呢度咧，我都差唔多想喊嘅。Every time I read this, I I I always have tears because how can we repay him? How can we repay him for all these things that he has done for us? There's no way. The only way that we can repay him is really walk on this path and be a better person in this life. At least in this life, try your best. Oh, 我哋真系大恩难报嘅啊！呢个恩啊，多过我哋嘅父母恩啊。因为点解啊？呢个令我哋出三界嘅。This this immense gratitude has to be. No, no, no other gratitude can surpass this gratitude. Even surpass the gratitude for our parents who has given, who have given us this body. Why? Because the Dharma, the Dharma is going to liberate us from the threefold world. We are going to be totally liberated from samsara, out of sufferings, and that's why it's immense gratitude. No matter how much we try, we cannot repay this. Except if you bow to pra- practice correctly and rightly. So, I always say that what fate is difficult, difficult to repay. Oh, in the verse it says, "Chu fate hei you ah, ha. You read English, you read Chinese ah, ha. I read English for you to listen." Buddhas, Buddhas have rare, immeasurable, un, and unlimited, inconceivably great power of divine faculties. 
tied neither to their thoughts nor actions, the kings of the Dharma, that means the Buddha. For the sake of the lowly, that means us, lowly, very low. Patiently endure. To common people attached to appearances, they preach what is appropriate with the Dharma. Buddhas have the greatest freedom. So the Buddha, he is a Fatoa. Fatoa, in this case, Fatoa has no two or three and two qualities. Why do you want to live as Fatoa? Why do you want to live as in the world? The world is a tool. Why do you want to live as in the world? Why do you want to live as a fan? Why do you want to live as a king? Why do you want to live as a king? Why do you want to live as a king? 佢因為要契機而化到我哋嘅，契我哋嘅機而化到我哋，導化我哋嘅，明嘛？我哋係人嘛？啊，你哋個個都有好多結結婚生仔啦，係咪？你學佛啦，即係話你哋都可以有機會成佛，我哋個個都可以有機會成佛。我、啊、所以呢、這個你話你個因大唔大？佢使咩咁做啫？佢唔需要咁做噶。佢真係唔需要咁做，但係佢佢佢咁樣做係因為為咗我哋啊！如果我哋能夠如法修行，我哋先至真真正正叫達佛因，報達佛因啊 ！So in here it says, "Ah, immeasurable power of divine, not tied neither to their thoughts nor actions." Why would why would the Buddha come into this world? This is a polluted world. This is a world with five turbidities. Why? Huh? Because we are his children. Because we are in the turbidities. So he has to enter into the turbidities to come and save us. To give us the teaching. And he came as a man He got married and had a son, and he got enlightened as a human being. So this metaphor said that we could be a Buddha because we are human beings. You are all you are married. Most of you are married. Most of you have children. So the Buddha had had the same kind of life, and he was a Buddha. He became a Buddha. So we. We have that potential to become a Buddha. So, you see, the Buddha actually entered this world with five turbidities for the sake of us, not for the sake of his own enlightenment. He didn't have to come into this world to become enlightened because of us. We are his audience because we are his children. So, as a father and as a mother, you would do everything for your children. I'm sure. Right? You always do. And same as the Buddha. So that's why I said, what we need to do for our parents, we need to do for the Buddha. Thousands, hundred thousands, million, ten million, hundred millions times more. Because his teaching is going to help us to totally liberate us from our sufferings, not anything else. 如果我哋能夠為我哋嘅父母親，我知道你哋好多人都係別人嘅父親母親。我好相信你哋咁多位都係會無條件去奉獻你哋自己，為你哋自己嘅子女。但係我哋，我哋點樣去為報答佛陀咧？咁，我哋真係要諗一諗。啊，你可以無條件為你嘅子女做幾多咧？如果我哋要報答佛陀嘅話，嗰啲係千千萬萬倍咁多，要報答佛陀。啊 ，so this is a question I leave to you to reflect on. Some reflections.
how are we going to repay? 我哋我留呢、这个呢、这个问题俾大家啊，谂下我哋应该点样报答佛陀？好啦，讲完啦 ，We done。誒，雖然我哋今次真係只係講到兩個兩個譬喻啊，嗬，但係我覺得呢兩個譬喻，我唔知道你哋啊，我自己受益好多，因為我好認真咁睇睇呢個譬喻品，我亦都好認真咁去思維個譬喻品。啊，你就算即係呢七個譬喻品，我都我都思維咗好深啊，我都睇咗好多書啦。咁啊，但係雖然只可以講到兩個譬喻，但我自己覺得。我哋如果能夠照住呢兩個譬喻去做嘅話，我哋已經好了不起啦，好了不起。So even though this、uh, we only have been, I have talked about two parables among the seven parables this time, and、uh, I don't know how much you have actually learned, how much you have grown,、um, how much you have been inspired by these two parables. But I myself have been Very much inspired because I have、um, I have contemplated, I have reflected because through the study, through the research on these seven parables, I have actually benefited so much, so much, and、uh, so I I I think even though we only have explore on two parables, but I'm sure if all of us can. Start to actually reflect more and more from learning of from these two parables, and to live our life bearing in mind the teachings in these two parables. I think that we would we would actually would be travel in high speed train towards there. Okay, 我哋会坐紧高铁去嗰度。Okay, high speed train. Going there, not there, but there. He's going to that. Not that. He's going to that. Okay. So, how much? Ah, ah. So, uh, we start the beginning of the Sutras. We start the Sutras. Okay. So, we will go back. So, we will dedicate our merits. Oh. Okay. Carry. Hi. Ah, in the Kongzi Yu, there, he mentioned one sentence. He said, "When we go to seek wisdom, we need to remember that we have no self, 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 no self." 嘅呢一個嘅心態咧嚟到去去做，咁、嗯、然後我哋咧即係自然嗰個寶藏咧，即係不求而有。係。咁但係誒頭先師傅又喺開場嘅時候咧，我哋去讀中嗰個《妙法蓮花經》嘅時候，到到觀世音菩薩普門品。咁、嗯、師傅頭誒有提過就係話誒，如果邊個想誒，即、呃、係、就是、有一個好好好嘅誒誒嘅 B B 啊咁嘅時候咧，誒、呃、我哋要為佢誒、呃、叫佢讀普門品啦、啊、咁。咁呢個係咪又係屬於叫做係有所求咧？當然啦，係啊。咁但係呢個求同誒、呃、師傅所講，我哋去修行嘅時候，我本無心嘅呢個差好遠啊。咁誒、呃，我想有個誒、呃、我嘅理解就係、是，我哋當我哋去讀呢個普門品，去誒、呃、為某一啲人去祈求嘅時候，呢、這個會唔會係屬於一種係當係一種祝福、一種回向？即係嗱，我讀呢個經，然後將佢回向翻俾嗰個人。咁希望佢會有某一種嘅誒利益，係咪咁嘅意思咧，師傅？你可以咁嘅意思，呢個係其中一個意思。第二個意思嘅就話，唔知你哋有冇誒記得咧？我我我成日都講，我哋誒未去到咁嘅境界咧，未去到一個睇到空嘅境界嘅時候，空性嘅境界嘅時候，我哋一定係從有入手啊！從有入手好安好安全嘅，因為至少我會懂得驚因果先、嗯。如果我從空我本無心啊，啊咁我咪唔使做咯，啊我就唔使收啦，啊我就坐喺度拗拗發拗竇嘅啫，咁咁就唔得咯，明嗎？啊，所以呢樣嘢係
係係係兩回事嚟㗎。嗯，啊，佢嗰個到到到無心嘅時候，佢實在已經見到空性㗎啦。嗯，佢已經見空性㗎啦，佢唔係唔係好似我哋啲凡夫俗子啦。嗬、啊，嗯，知道嗎？明啦，嗬。明白。啊、okay. ，Kerry asked a question. I don't know whether I can find the I I can find this um uh this verse here like a yip. Like he called it, um, get up. Hi, how you doing? Kerry asked this question about uh, when, when, and he thought, without any intention or effort on my part, these treasures have now come to me by myself, by themselves. And and she said in the beginning when I when I was talking about the the the, the chapter on the Guanyin uh, Guanyin Pusa, the chapter of Gateway of Guanyin Pusa. She said, "Isn't that a little bit uh, contradicted?" And then, uh, so what? What? What is it? And then, if if I'm doing this for just to dedicate the merits, so that would that be considered as without any intention? Without any intention, that means without any expectations for one benefit. Okay, so you can do it for others, but as I always say, this. Oh, I mean, uh, let me say this first. Okay, these without any intention or effort on my part. That means these, these, the 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 poor son has already seen the truth of emptiness. Has already understood. Completely understood the truth of em emptiness, and the dependent or the dependent origination arising. So he's not attached to anything. Neither attached to there is or attached to there isn't. Okay, but for us, as 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 very ordinary people, we have to start from something there is first. Otherwise, if oh there isn't, then we don't have to be we don't have to abide by the law of cause and effect. We don't have to be scared. We don't have to to do wholesome things because there isn't. There isn't consequences, and I, I, it doesn't matter because I have no intention. I have no intention to hurt you, but I hurt you. I'm sorry. I kill you, but I I have no intention to whatever. You see that then people will will start to take excuse because there isn't. I have no such intention, but no. So it's better to start off with there is. There is this cause and effect. There is this dependent origination, and you start to understand more and more and more and more. You start to be inspired. You start to walk, and you start to see the truth more and more. Eventually, one day, you really penetrate to the truth of emptiness. Then that's it. You you come to without any intention. Okay. All right. Make my heart. Okay. Good. If you have any questions, please ask me tomorrow. 聽日我哋有一個鐘頭可以誒、uh, 做分享。If you have any more question, you can save it for tomorrow. We have one hour、uh, for discussion and sharing. Okay. 好、oh, 啊，我哋今晚回鄉啦嚇。Okay. Now we dedicate our merits. Now you say it in English, and we、uh, those who say in Chinese can say in Chinese. We we do it all together. 願以此功德普及於一切我等與眾生。皆共成佛道。May we wish more and more people will encounter the words of the Buddha, study it, practice it, and help themselves to liberate themselves from their own entanglements, sufferings, and let the treasures come naturally. 我哋祝願有更多嘅人能夠可以接觸到佛法，聽聞佛法，能夠修行，可以讓自己從自己嘅苦入邊解脱出嚟，讓呢啲寶藏自然而來，變得更長和、更自在。OK， good night。I love this picture。我好中意呢張相嘅，佛陀。对住只大象啊 ！You see the a big elephant? Ah,、oh, big elephant. We are the big elephant. 好靓啊！呢张相
ค่ะแหมอีซีบิวตี้ฟูลพิคเจอร์ค่ะตายเป็นจังอ่ะค่ะโอเลยก็ก็ต้องให้จะตายเป็นจัง We are all a big elephant <laughs> Allow the Dharma to tame you โอเคให้มองโอเลฟัดโอยีจะโอเลห้องฟูโอเลยโอเคก็มหัวละโอเลฟัฟฟ้ากิ้งเกอร์啊，開始到此為止啦。OK， 啊、uh, ，希望大家有所成長。So the Dharma, the Dharma discourse of Lotus Sutra ends here. I hope everybody will, uh, will will gain something and mature on this path. Good night. <coughs>